The owners of this country know the truth. It's called the American dream. Because you have to be asleep to believe it. Some police violence. I mean, it, it speaks for itself. Anybody gets the lyrics, anybody's gonna sing along, they kind of know where I'm coming from. Touching on uh, police violence, you know, which is a very, you know, current affair. It's, it, it's you know, in my opinion, a, a serious issue that everyone needs to, needs to address. We can't overlook it, you know, it's like, um, Things have just gotten out of hand. With the, with the police just going far and beyond what they're supposed to do, you know, uh, realistically, you know, we employ them, you know, and we expect a certain courtesy from them too, you know. We live in a time where, you know, cop or criminal, <laughs> you can't get away with the things you used to get away with. Like, you know, they, just because they got badges doesn't mean they're better than us, doesn't mean they, they, sh they should, act like every average gangster or every, 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 every criminal. They got this elite brotherhood. And the, and the fact that cops are behaving like criminals, that's even more horrendous, you know, because they're supposed to be there to protect and serve, make people feel safe, you know. Uh, and I'm not saying that, you know, they're not doing that to a certain extent in certain areas, but it's obvious to everyone that, you know, in New York especially, and in places like LA, I mean, there's, you know, an abuse, you know, of power going on, serious. I was in Wall Hill Correctional Facility, that was the last prison I got out of, and that was back then, before I went in, was the, the institution that had New York City for the police. They were kept, even when they were sent to the prison system, they were sent to a good, nice prison jail that had boxing, had all this stuff. Eventually, the whole, you know, correctional facility got overcrowded and after years they had to do away with that and they started setting regular criminals in there so that they couldn't protect them either. So even in, in, the, in the judicial system, even in the correctional system, they're still protected and that stuff, it's gotta come to an end.